bleeding. What a shame. Oh, what a, thank you. You're bleeding. Yeah, I know. What happened? I just broke a glass. It's fine. Okay. Um, hold that on there. I'll get you a band-aid. Okay. No matter what you say, he loves me. He loves you because he doesn't really know you. Or we're married. Nothing's ever going to change that. Maybe not. Maybe you two will be very happy. But I doubt it. I'm happy. Lathan's going to be here to remind you every day that you killed his mother. I wish you would stop that. Can you live with that? Hmm? Every day you're going to have to look into that little trusting face and remember that the only way you managed to get Ethan was by murder. Ethan is that little boy's father. How you can keep that information from the man that you supposedly love is beyond me. So, uh, Gertrude, I would love to have the details of your work history. Oh, I don't really like talking about myself. Oh, uh, honey, I mean, you have to talk about yourself in a job interview. Well, I just, you know, it always seems like I'm bragging. <laughs> Only if you're good. Okay, look, if you don't like to toot your own horn, then you can just give us your resume and we can verify a few things. Yeah, you, you, you want to see my resume? Yes, you are going to be taking care of our grandchildren. But you already offered me the job. <laughs> and now I would like to see your resume. Oh, I'm so sorry. But I don't have a resume. What? We don't have a resume? No. Well, that's it then. You certainly can't hire her without a resume.